Hello? Right. You all right? Yeah. You all right? How about you guys? Barely managed, exactly. but we're all right. The chopper? We need some time for repairs. No doubt. Uh, no the doubt. president's all yours. Okay. Can I ask you something? What? Are What's you this date the tomorrow? Snake? My girlfriend's mad they at said me. You were dead. No, not me. Exactly. There's still too many things I need to do. Mm. Snake, you're a legend, and that's why I need to ask you this. Legend? Exactly. A legend is nothing but fiction. Someone tells it, someone else remembers. Everybody passes it on. I'm here because I was assigned to this mission, not because I want to. If I could, I'd be out of here in a second. How could exactly. you come back to all this? Why keep fighting? There's something my best friend said to me once. What? We're not tools what? of the government or anyone else. Fighting was the only thing I was good at, but at least I always fought for what I believed in. What about, what about the DNA results from that body? DNA results. That was Liquid's body. He and Snake are identical on the genetic level. Liquid? A deception for our own protection. We stole his frozen mm. body from some organization. Kind of a hassle, though. That's all there is to it. Are you two really an NGO? Insofar as we're a non-profit What's organization of civilians advocating a cause, yes. The cause happens to be the eradication of Metal Gear. We work on it's our kind own, of a hassle, though. but it's a cause worth fighting for. Why would you stick your neck out for something this risky? That's the way I used to look at it, four years ago. Mm. I was holed up in the middle of no Non-government thank you. Drinking too much. We have a responsibility I was a musher. for the coming generations. To the world. I was a musher, goddammit. To keep track of the mistakes we've made as a species. We need to remember, to spread the word, to fight for change. And that's what keeps me alive. You think you can change the future? Nah, I'm not as arrogant as that. What you do isn't grassroots activism. It's more like terrorism. I'm I not a terrorist. That. But our group, Philanthropy, received some information. A new Metal Gear prototype was being developed here, and terrorists were planning to raid the facility. The information came from a very reliable source. Mm. So you're here to... We're here to stop all that. But I also have a personal motive. Looks like the terrorists have his sister in the big shell. We're here on our own, not under anyone's orders. We have our own battles. Otacon's here for someone. I'm not. This is a military mission. I love how it's always just like a million calls. Right? Oh, just hi, barely. love. Um, you almost gave me a heart attack. Sorry, it wasn't intentional. I know that. And I know I need to stay stronger. Don't put Save yourself down, girl. Walls, so He's I a bad boyfriend. Back. He doesn't remember you what April is. I'm with you all the way, remember. That means a lot to me, you know. I'm going to save the data, okay, Jack? Discount Aerith! Oh my god. 13. I'm lucky for some. Not us. I can't even make the thing go on. Colonel, Metal Gear has already gone active. It's not too late. You can still prevent a nuclear strike by securing the president and preventing password confirmation from taking place. Get to the president. He's in the core section of Shell 2. I'm checking I know. the satellite images. Looks like you can get to the core from the other side of Strut L. The core hasn't gone under yet from what we can tell. Follow the railings down, then jump onto the pipes. Okay. The only viable strut in the outer perimeter is the L. That attack We're gonna take a real L, L here, sense. huh? It's like they have no more use for this place. Uh, Colonel, you are monitoring the codec calls. That man was the real snake all <gasps> along. Maybe. 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 All I know is my gut say says maybe. Because they were never a part of the simulation. They're an unknown factor. You can take your simulation and we're out here. We bleed. We die. Calm down. I suggest that you do, right Even Got it that memorized. Snake, that has no bearing on your mission. Colonel, you and Snake used to be on the same side. I don't understand. I read about you and Snake in In the Darkness of Shadow Moses. I don't give a Who's damn. Who's writing a book about this? Said. Do you get Did me? Did Archon write some like fanfic? I think that would just be sweet. <laughs> I know, right? As you use subtext and they're all cowards. Um. Okay, so that's H C. Where's L? That one. Okay. P 
Peanut check-in time. Oh, she, Natasha wrote a book. Uh, let me check in and see where she is. I'll do a quick a quick check-in with Peanut. I know, there's so many lights. Do you have any words of wisdom? No. Peanuts dream. You wanna get down? There you go, sweet pea. Oh, were you clicked on? Yeah, okay, let me put you down on the bed. That's my girl. That's not the real peanut. That's Iroquois Bliskin. I'm sorry. Anyway, hi, yeah, that was my peanut. Gotta be very careful with how I pronounce that, but that's, <laughs> that's peanut. She's the sweetest. I love you. Anyway, okay. <laughs> and, and your peanut break was brought to you by my cat, Peanut. I miss TBD. <laughs> she was only TBD for like a day, but I, I kept calling her like peanut. Um, I do want to get a peanut cat, but the problem is, is that I have a cat tree for her. I have a um, bed for her and she doesn't care about either of them. Um, Iroquois, peanut, rosy snake, that's her name. Um, but she, just sits on the ottoman at the bottom of my bed. It's quite funny. Um, I'm hoping that she'll enjoy the cat tree eventually. I did buy like a, one of those litter trays in like a little cupboard and it has like a little mat on for her. So hopefully she enjoys that too. Uh, no, yeah, I could get, I could just get her a, a cat bed, a cat tree shaped like Big Shell and maybe she'd prefer that. Uh, okay, so where am I going? Gotta go back. Oh wait, hang on. No. You know what? I have an ordinary box and she doesn't really care about that either. She's just a baby. She's six years old, so don't let that baby face fool you. Am I going the right way, by the way? There was a ration down here and I was... Oh, okay. This doesn't feel... Right? Don't be irrational. Doesn't feel right. Just doesn't feel good to be climbing like this. <laughs> Come on. Eh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, fine. Go up here. Summarize what's happening in Metal Gear in my own words. <laughs> so, summarizing Metal Gear Solid 2 in my own words, okay. Raiden has been sent two, two years ago. This place was built to house another Metal Gear. Um, and Snake was sent, um, and Snake was killed there. Revolver Ocelot is there working with um, the guy whose name began, began with G. Uh, Russian then he was in the end of the first game and then I fought his daughter Olga who was pregnant um, snake died big shell incident it was a warm summer's day and then two years later Raiden gets sent in um, as does a mysterious SWAT team with a guy called Pliskin in it who's actually snake Raiden's here because the president is here and he has the uh, codes to use um, the Metal Gear and 
Um, he was captured and everyone thinks. Yeah, also the Metal Gear has nuclear weapons. And, um, uh, but now, is the president Solidus Snake? There's a group of terrorists with, with, with nuclear weapons. Not anymore. Okay, ex-president Solidus Snake, who's another clone. Liquid's dead. Revolver Ocelot is just being a menace. We've got a new president. Am I getting... There's a vampire for some reason. There's Fortune. There was Fat Man. Killed him. New Prez has a power suit. I'm some kind of ninja. Um... There was Peg Leg Pete. <laughs> um, Ram can run on war. I think, I think I got it. I think I got it. And Toby Blue, thank you so much for the sub, by the way. Haven't met New Press. Okay. I don't know. I feel like I got the big beats there. Um, okay. Come on, come on. Flip. Flip. Yeah, there you go. And also that guy was back having another big shit in the toilet. Oh, come on, boys. This is not a pretty sight. Check the situation. Don't do that. Uh... I, I was just slightly down. Just slightly down. Oh, come on. Happens to the best of us. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, slippery floor. Oh, I don't feel good about that at all. I, I want this ration. I... I just don't want it to be the death of me. <laughs> like, literally just entered the stream to watch you do that, and then you left. <laughs> Wouldn't blame you. This is 20 minutes from Manhattan. You can probably see this from like the ferry. Go, 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 go. If you get through the next area without an alert, you get a great Easter egg scene. Well, hope we're all prepared to YouTube that later. <laughs> Louis, thank you for hanging out, mate. Good night. Right, what's wrong? Right, right. <laughs> Doctor Benway, Lucy. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, only the most highly skilled agents um, get to do this. <laughs> right. Again, we're going for the ration, I'm sorry. Ooh, don't speed up. Oh, hey, the bar, thank you for the cheer. <laughs> oh. And like I said, I'm probably not going to do this bit without getting... <laughs> Ryden, what's going on? Ryden! Ryden! How did I not get that? Any time. I didn't get that the first two times. And he just... Wait, Lulu, is there more? Is there more bird poop I have to be careful? Okay, again, sorry, we're going for the ration. Dire Straits. Great band from the northeast of England. And also Mark Knopfler did the music for the Princess Bride, which is one of my favorite. Do not slip. Okay, thank God. <gasps> okay. the goddamn wall. This is not a pretty sight. Does is this floor gonna uh wait how do I do this? Can I jump? 
Cartwheel? Why is he shaking? Uh, okay, uh... Oh, okay, yeah, clean. This one. Yeah, to be fair, it's like when you go on um, like a really high bridge or something, this big rickety. I would also be shaking. Uh, don't listen to Tam. It's not A to get up. It's Y on Xbox. Okay. No, mate. No! No, this isn't happening. Jack, you have to answer me. Jack! Jack! The frustrating thing is that 50% of the time you have said we should listen to town. No. I refuse. Feel free to swear. Don't tempt me with a good time. Uh, what do you have? Come on, what? I shot him, right? Or did it bounce off the glass? Is there glass? as we've discovered. No, 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 don't wake him up, don't wake him up. Oh my god, please do it away. Freeze! Oh. Oh my god. Freeze! <gasps> oh. And then there's what? There's that thing over here. Oh. sounds like it was recorded separately. You know? Oh my god, he must have thighs of steel. Get up. Okay. Oh god. Book it. Did I get peed on yet? This stream. Wait here. Oh. Uh. 
Oh god, okay, yeah, a lot of them, huh? Lot of boys. Yeah, I feel I feel like I did not get the Easter egg because I uh, kind of biffed it a little bit. They are boys, they're drone boys. Go, 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 go. Oh, wait, I need to be an L, right? Oh no, I can get in this way. That's fine. Oh, maybe I can't. Is that bust? Looks pretty bust. <sighs> oh, it's L. Just in case. Moving box. Nothing there. Okay. Oh. Why? Level five? I guess I have to go down here then. Right? That didn't feel good at all. First try. See, it only counts if you do like a little noise. Father had some unfinished business with him. Olga, calm yourself. Wait. What's this? And I went to Oh. My old man. The launch comes first. I was like, what the hell's happening here? What is also on? Oh. I don't trust him. Don't talk that way about one of your own. He's not one of my own. He left my father to die, remember? Olga, Did you know? we'll talk later. We need to get started on the final checks for the unit. All right. I'm headed back there. Back like where? The upper connecting bridge to Shell 1 is down. What about the chopper? The cam off is out of action. Take the oil fence from Strut L. I'll tell my men to start pulling out. Not yet. Their retrieval comes last. The intruder's still at large. Snake. What about the other man? Oh, okay, okay, that's very side, close. Certainly. He survived that explosion. Listen, Olga, the court confirmation is in one hour. Keep the president alive until then. I know. No one gets in here. Turn the currents on. Oh, of course. Oh no, that doesn't sound good. Oh, I'm 
you get zapped so much. The door stays shut unless the president manages to take out that circuit panel from inside the room. And it's no job for bare hands. All right. Come back immediately. So I feel like, One you know, thing. in Pokemon, what? where Team Rocket get, like, we rubber gloves Russia and they feel like they done. are invincible against Pikachu. For that. Of course. That was part of the agreement. We start living for ourselves after this. Because to stay here, I want you to take good care of them. Gladly. Gerlukovich soldiers are the cream of the crop. It's time they went free. What happened to rebuilding Mother Russia? The old man is dead. The world is a different place now. It's your life. Just as a reminder, I'm going to say this again one last time. Don't try anything on us. The feeling hmm. is mutual. I'm in front of the room where they're keeping the president. Everything all right? No sign of flooding, but I can't get close to the door. The floor is electrified. Don't test it. This is some You'll mission be impossible. <laughs> Any suggestions? <laughs> okay. Remember the Shadow Moses VR training. Take out the circuit panel? Right. But there's no way into the room. Try ventilation ducts. Yeah, I think I see one. Look for a remote so, okay, control actually, missile launcher. Mission you can guide it through the duct into the room. Look for and a remote control missile launcher. Panel. Yeah, there's just Got one it. hanging around right. everywhere. But make sure you don't hit the president. Don't hit the, the president. president. is wired with nano machines. If we know the frequency, I can raise him. We've tried that don't repeatedly, the but there's no response. With it looks remote like control the walls missile. have a built-in radio shield. So that's why Got Ames it. lost contact with him. If you need to confirm his position, you can log into the node. I do Understood. Like the node. Locate a remote control missile launcher first. Oh, get the nerd. Uh, it's just called Prez. Okay, there was something down here. Jump up. Okay, well, there's Nikita. Me. 
Was kann ich dir? Guarded place. Seems suspicious. Do a flip. Oh. Wait, how do I get in there? Is that not a um Gotta go in that room with the cameras? Oh. I thought that was a um little vent, but I guess not. in here is pick up. Okay. Ooh, filtration chamber. This seems like if you hold the cartwheel button down we go prone. Yes! Okay, that's good knowledge. Oh. Well, we took a little trip. I was just gonna go downstairs, do a little car wheel, and then go back up. Okay. Uh, oh, nerd. Sweet, thank you. What is that? What's that blue light? Oh, I just say no like that because I remember in that first cutscene someone said it and it was very funny to me. Uh, what? Uh oh, is my frame rate gone? Maybe try rebooting? It seems okay on my side. At least OBS hasn't shat itself. Makes a change. Cool. Fix itself. Let me know if anything happens, I'll see what I can do. Uh Bro, what? I need to stop saying bro. I don't know why I've stopped saying bro. Why are these cans following me? I assume they make a noise. Uh... Uh, how do I dip again? And now's not the time. Turn over. B1 is completely flooded from what I can see. You'll have to swim through. Fine. Good. Swimming. Glad I called Stroke you. Stroke the water and move forward by pushing the punch button. Okay. Push it in rapid succession to swim uh, faster. Uh, 
-huh. Change your heading with the left stick. Okay. Up will take you up, down takes you lower. Left Good. and right to face yeah. those directions. The O2 gauge will appear mm. under your life gauge while you're underwater. Probably the there gauge now. corresponds to the amount of air you can hold from a single deep breath. Once the O2 gauge falls mm. to zero, the life gauge will start mm -hmm, to drop. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You need to be aware of that. And I'm guessing that I have to avoid the the cans. It doesn't seem like, you know, oh my god, oh my good lord. Do the cans matter? Oh, I don't know where I'm going, by the way. Prepare for a lot of drowning. Ooh, what's that, what's that, what's that? Pick it up, pick it up. NVG, oh, I'm gonna die. No, it's up, up, it's up, 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 up. <sighs> Look, thick thighs, so thighs save lives. Oh my god, oh my god. What the? Is that an air pocket? No, okay. We persevere. Mm. Okay, bud. Okay. Oh, so I can surface for air here. That's good. Thank you. Ryden always has time for the ladies. Don't tell Rose. Okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't mean to go that far down. Come on. Dude, now's not the time! <laughs> I gotta get out of here! Uh, <laughs> is there anything else useful down here? I don't feel like there is. I feel like I've, I've done... Oh, I am still bleeding though. That's probably not good. Yeah, I'm gonna... I need to get out of the water and... Bandage up. Okay. Uh, okay. Is there anything else in here? I don't think there was. Uh, Beware of sharks. I was just thinking that. I was like, there would probably be a shark in here just for no reason. Sexy. Look, no king shame. But I've got questions for you. Alright. Okay, we got the Nikita. There were more bullets for it down here, so we can quickly grab those. Um, I don't need to get them from that. Do I have to be in that room to? Oh, please don't tell me I have to be in that room to fire the missile. So, do I fire it through here?
No. Oh my god. No. What is that? I have options. So there's this one. And then there's... Can I get in that room? Good to know. Oh, there is a vent in the camera room. Okay. But I feel like I would have to destroy the cameras for that. Prez seems fine, you know? Can I destroy the cameras? I feel like I must be able to. Okay, they are, they are the world's most indestructible cameras. Come here. Thank you. joking when you said there is a thing in here. Do it- oh, from the box. Ah, okay. Excellent. Is there a way to slow down this missile? Oh. Okay, don't hit Prez. Don't- What is it? Don't- Do we do it? Please say we did it. <laughs> Easy. All right. Flip over that railing. Oh, <laughs> that's a great word, man. Which railing? Oh, in, uh, in here. He won't flip over it. He will not flip over it. I'm afraid, no flipping. Good try, though, time. Just checking in on that floor. I'm not going back. We'll YouTube it later if we need to. Hello, Mr. Perez. President Johnson! Huh? So you're finally here. You've been expecting me? Your equipment, that skull suit, isn't exactly standard military issue. Are you all right, sir? Is this some kind, kind of, exposition of time. sick joke? I thought you came to kill me. What? I'm prepared to face the consequences of my betrayal. What are you- oh. Hmm. Did he just- What the- Cup him? You're- What was that? A man? Hmm. Well, who are you? Foxhound, sir. Here? Foxhound? I see. Now things are starting to make a little sense. <laughs> Switch over to nano communication so nobody can listen in. Yes, sir. Now, oddly prescient. Do you read me, sir? Uh, yes. Mr. President. It's my understanding that the terrorists have managed to input the code sequence necessary for launching a nuclear strike. That's correct. That's I exactly punched it. the sequence in myself. You're working Why? for them? If you asked me two hours ago, my answer would have been yes. Right now, they're keeping me alive until my vital signs are reconfirmed. They betrayed you? I wouldn't quite put it that way. Mm. I wanted power. They sought destruction. But why stoop to terrorism? I wanted absolute power. But you're the president. You're literally the president. You have power. No, I'm just a figurehead. Huh? I don't have any control. The <gasps> real power is in the Patriots' hands. Excellent. The Patriots? The truth behind this country. 
So basically, the Illuminati. Never heard of them. Very few are aware of their existence, even among those with code word clearance. Huh? Politics, the military, Just the, the economy. Mark. They control it all. They even choose who okay, becomes president. Okay, thank you for Putting it Cheering. simply, the for patriots the rule patriots. this country. No. Cheering on Fox out. Hmm. Hard to believe, it, it? but it's the truth. The space defense, income tax reduction, and national missile defense programs. NMD. Every policy that's been credited to me was actually done according to their instructions. Space defense was initiated by Congress. No. That's what the patriots want the country to believe. It's all a show. Democracy is just a filler for textbooks. Think about it. Damn. Do you actually believe that public opinion influences the government? No. Increasingly not. This country is shaped and controlled as the patriots see fit. The people are shown what they want to believe. What you call government is actually a well-staged production aimed at satisfying the public. Oh huh? boy. Don't look at me like that. I'm legally sane, you know. It's not I'm your legally sanity sane, that worries you know. me. The Patriots. Here we go. Even I don't know who the actual members are. Are they financial, political, or military leaders? No one knows who the Patriots really are. Even my instructions come from a cutout. A cardboard cutout? All I've been told is that every key decision is made by a group of 12 men known as the Wise Men's Committee. Your office? The White House? A Merely sham. puppets. Pawns in a game. By pledging my loyalty, an insignificant son of a senator was awarded the presidency. Huh. Of course, that wasn't the only price I had to pay. What do you mean? Even if a pawn becomes a queen, it is still just a But I thought this piece. was all men. I wanted to leave my own mark in history. But my ambitions were... Lofty. You'll understand someday. Mm. I wished to be a member of the Patriots. I wanted to wield the power of a king instead of being an expendable pawn. And that justifies acts But no one of would know it was you. Yes. I'd intended to use the new Metal Gear as a bargaining chip. Bargaining chip? But I underestimated some of this. He actually wants to challenge the Patriots, even if it means the destruction of the world. What are you saying? Whether you believe it or not, the balance of power rests in the hands of the Patriots. Mm -hmm. They regulate the country's various interests through controlled presentation, staging a drama that is palatable to the general masses. Can you imagine what would happen if they ceased to function? Chaos. Picture uh -huh. a massive political vacuum. A space that every power monger will try to fill for their own greedy ends. I'm talking about an unregulated power struggle. Panic, civil war, chaos. Like it or not, the Patriots is an organization that must continue to exist. So you changed your mind because you wanted to avoid global chaos. Exactly. When I told Solidus that I wished to prevent disaster, he replied that pawns can never become players. Damn, and who all is right. this Solidus? <laughs> My chaos. predecessor, George Sears. That was the name the public came to know him by. I knew him by his code name, Solidus Snake. He was the third snake, preceded by Solid and Liquid, a survivor of the Les Enfants Terribles project. Neither Solid nor Liquid. He was, he was a, a well-balanced masterpiece that the Patriots saw fit to entrust with the presidency. However, he fell out of grace with the organization four years ago. When acting on his own, he started an incident. Four Shadow years ago. Moses? Shadow Moses. <gasps> That's right. At the time, the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson, together with certain influential parties, initiated the development of Metal Gear Rex and an advanced nuclear warhead. However, this did not fall in line with the Patriots' plans. What's more, Solidus decided on his own to send his most trusted man, Ocela, to provoke Liquid Snake, bringing about the said incident. As a result, he succeeded in obtaining Rex and the data on the warhead. But in doing so, he ended up revealing the existence of both Rex and the Genome Army, mm -hmm. a blunder that earned him the wrath of the Patriots. Did do that. Shortly thereafter. 
Solidus was removed from the presidential office. Okay. I thought he resigned. That's the story given to the general public. Following his resignation, the Patriots selected me, their new pawn for the presidency. But that would mean that the presidential race was That a was fake. quite a show, wasn't it? It was a well-scripted drama staged by the Patriots for the benefit of the public. Even the Democrats and Republicans were dancing to the Patriots' tune. Everything went according to plan, but for one exception. Huh. Following his resignation, Solidus' health was scheduled to Ooh. fail, bringing about his untimely death. Capped? Correct. But before the Patriots could execute their plot, Solidus went underground with the help of Ocelot. As he avoided pursuit, Solidus gained control of Dead Cell, Good winning game. over Colonel Golukovich's outfit. From there, he bided his time, knowing that his opportunity would soon arrive. What opportunity? The completion of the new Metal Gear project, an opportunity that would even his odds against the Patriots. By stealing the Patriots' most valued project, he would be able to place them in a very uncomfortable position. It's the only chance he has for survival. Once he has the new Metal Gear, he'll declare war against the Patriots. Needless to say, he must be stopped. Metal Gear is already operational. Oh. No, not yet. Post a check. Hmm? What you saw was Metal Gear Ray, hijacked two uh -huh. years ago from the Marines by Ocelot. That was not the new Metal Gear. So there's another so one? the new Metal Gear. Right here. With what? Ray, Rex? You're standing in it. To be more precise, this entire big shell facility is the new Metal Gear. What'd you say? No, I'm What'd quite you say? serious. The upper structure that you've seen is camouflage, designed to represent an offshore cleanup facility. The main structure like... extends from the oh, foundation God. all the way down to the ocean floor. The connecting elevator is located on the B2 floor of the Shell 1 core. Arsenal gear. That's Arsenal gear. Name for the new Metal Gear. Arsenal? Ars gear. Get your ass into That's gear. right. Arsenal. We're talking about an impregnable fortress carrying a load of over a couple of thousand missiles, including nuclear warheads, all protected by a horde of mass-produced Metal Gear a Ray units. A horde of Metal Gear Rays. Produced. The Ray unit was originally designed for the Marines to be used as a countermeasure against the Metal Gear variations throughout the world. The Patriots had Ray redesigned to protect the new Arsenal gear. So now anti-Metal Gears are guarding a Metal Gear. Ironic, isn't it? It That's is. Not all. Arsenal it Gear is, has Chris. full access to the military's tactical network. Of course it does. It the ability to exercise this absolute is totally control fine. over our nation's armed forces, not to mention our nuclear armament. In short, Arsenal was created to be the core of our country. Like this is some Skynet kind of idiotic shit. idiotic weapon? Weapon? No. You're not seeing the full picture. Huh? Arsenal Gear is more than just a military tool. It's a political one. It is a means to preserve the world as it is. It will establish a new form of control. The Patriots will use it to keep their place as the country's true rulers. Right now, they feel pressured and threatened. By what? They fear an overabundance of digital information. The world will drown in the coming flood of information, and they along with it. I mean... Hmm. The Arsenal plans include a system to digitally manage the flow of information, <laughs> what? making it possible to shape the truth for their own purposes. In short, the Arsenal system is the key to their supremacy. The key? Yes. The GW system is the Patriots' trump card. Arsenal gear will be fully operational when this GW is successfully Jesus integrated. Christ. Once operational, it will be a completely so new form of power for the Patriots oh, to wield. I had hoped to seize the project from them, so that I would be in a strong bargaining position. Bargain for what? I'd hoped to trade my way into their ranks. But Solidus preferred rebellion. Outer Heaven, his plan to unleash a nuclear blast over the skies of Wall Street to break the Patriots' control over the business community, is also a key factor what? in his offensive effort. <laughs> Outer Heaven? Listen, there isn't much time. The football served as the key for activating Arsenal gear. I've already input the necessary code sequence. It won't be long before GW begins to establish connections with other external systems, and Arsenal gear becomes fully operational. 
Stop them before that happens. That is your role. Role? You've got to find Emma Emmerich. She's the only one who can stop Wait, that thing once it's been that? activated. Is that Hal's sister? Emmerich? She's the system programmer for Arsenal Gear. I believe she's somewhere on level B1 in the Has core she got of this a funny building. Walk? I thought the levels below us were flooded. I'm sure they won't let her die just yet, as she's the only remaining programmer for this project. According to Ocelot, she was being held in a locker room located in the northwest part of level B1. Cut transmission and get moving. <sighs> this is card four. It'll give you access all the way to Emma's location. Oh, yeah. Give this to her when you find her. What is it? A program for disrupting the control functions between GW and Arsenal Gear. Take Emma to the computer room on level B2. Shell one core. She'll know how to load the program into the main system. A virus? That's right. Modeled after Foxta. <gasps> a biological weapon designed biological to selectively weapon, eliminate personnel with a specific genetic code. But why do you have it? The Patriots had it engineered as a failsafe. And Ocelot forgot to search me. Oh, You've got Ocelot. to hurry. That disc is the only way you're going to stop Arsenal. And I'm afraid you're going to have to shove it up your Arsenal to take it there. Well, I've told you everything you need to know. Kill me. What's he gonna do? There's only one thing that remains <gasps> to be done. Huh. You need to kill me. Now, kill me. Ah, I knew it! I knew it! What the? Yeah! There's no time to argue. The final check for my vital ID will start any second. If you kill me now, you'll at least prevent the nuclear strike. Kill, kill him! Cut it out! Uh, oh my god, do it. Raiden. That's her role! Uh, oh. No! Do it! That's abusing your right to free speech, Mr. President. What? Or is it? Ex-president. The president! Why did you... Alas, my finger must have slipped. I'll see you around, carrier boy. <laughs> carrier boy! Don't forget him. He did us a favor. Without free will, there is no difference between submission and rebellion. My only real choice is to put it in I absolutely did forget the word, charade. but I'm so sorry. Let me at least have the freedom to end it myself. What are you? Find Emma. Stop Arsenal. This is my last order as your commander in chief. I'm counting on you. Oh. 